when you walked through those doors. A perfect picture of stupefaction. They could not believe their eyes. Though I confess, I had my own doubts whether or not you would accept my invitation. Such shocking news. Sid isn't a son of a whore. He's the son of an empress. Your own dear Clive. Absurd. Who fed you these lies? I have never spent a moment among criminals, save at the gallows. I came here with my son. Not to entertain your baseless accusations, but to put an end to the senseless hostilities between our nations. Very well. You need only agree to the terms I set out. Sid took the life of someone dear to me. A woman by the name of Benedicta. I swore to take his in turn. This would not be disagreeable to you, I take it. You would finally be rid of the stain on your noble name. In return, I will leave Sandbreck in your capable hands. Your Imperial Majesty. And all for the love of a common whore. <laughs> Dominant or no, one cannot hide one's breeding. And beasts will ever belong with beasts. <laughs> there are greater things in store for you, my darling Olivier. Soon enough, you shall be the crown prince of Sambrec. And when your father goes to meet Great Grieger, you shall be emperor of all you survey. The old order shall come tumbling down, and you will rebuild the world in your glorious image. <laughs> Soon. <laughs> 